this smash and grab mess, oh my goodness, it don't make any sense, man. And oh, look at him. It's fun. It's a game, huh? It's, it's fun. It's a game, huh? That is crazy. It, bro, bro, this smash and grab mess. Oh, my goodness. It don't make any sense, man. And, and, and you see how they laughing, they giggling or whatever. Going into that, what is that, WSS? Yeah. That's, I think there's a home base in Cali over there in L.A. But, dude, what is going on? Is that the American dream right there? <laughs> to, to steal? And not steal go to, from the I stove? mean, come on. You remember how they got these little rules where it can't go be over $1,000? If it's under a thousand dollars, they can't do anything. To so that them. means do nothing, huh? Yes, yes. And man. maybe I don't know what they do with the what? security personnel that's there. Tell them don't. But it, it doesn't matter if it's a thousand. They have to get enough stuff, enough merchandise. And if it's not enough, they get six hundred dollars, seven hundred dollars worth of stuff. They come back the next day and do it again, and do it again, and do it again. <laughs> Cali is Cali is just so crazy, man. I I, I don't I, I don't know I don't know, man. It's just so crazy. Their rules, thinking that people are running around here, um, uh, you know, I guess quote unquote homeless, and they need this stuff, so they are stealing from these Fortune five hundred companies okay. or whatever. But then the Fortune five hundred company is just going to leave out of that area. They're gonna be like, you know, we'll close that store. Okay. You know what? You're going you, you're going to let this pass. You're going to let this slide. I yeah, I didn't use up my insurance. My insurance didn't jumped up. So now, I'm moving out. I'm moving out. So now y'all don't have access. I'm going somewhere where it's safe. Well, well, first of all, those individuals, I could probably pretty much guarantee those individuals that just did that act right there. They're not homeless. They're not no. homeless. So no. we can continue and people will blame everything on the homeless, but people doing these mm -hmm. smash and grabs and yep. you know what they usually doing is selling it out on the street, you know, yeah, keeping what they want to keep. Uh, but this has to stop. And if you for this, well, they just kids and they're young. No, let's get them. Mm -hmm. No. Forget that. Because again, if you had a business, you wouldn't want this to happen. Forget just saying, well, insurance gonna cover it. Yeah. No. That's not how we gonna insurance will cancel. You. <laughs> come on. After so many payouts. Man, come on. they be like, you know, we can't deal with you. You in a rough neighborhood and you susceptible to all this theft. Or so. it'll go up to an exorbitant right. amount and you can't even afford to pay it. Then Mm -hmm. So yeah. uh, for the parents, even the, 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 the teenagers that's doing it and the young adults, come on. I, I'm for I'm for the, the, the prosecution of these individuals. They yeah. keep doing it. They keep doing it. Yeah. No, we don't have time for that. And yeah. I was say, I agree. I, I agree. Jane, I was uh, I was going to Home Depot. Uh, and a guy, man, that dude was he was running. He he, he was getting his, out of home. He, he was getting his dash on. First, he was pushing uh <laughs> one guy was pushing a, a cart, and uh mm -hmm. they had uh let me see those uh when you're cleaning homes or a sidewalk, uh the pressure washer. Yes. Oh, they had okay. pressure washers in there and everything. So they had a a, a basket. Yes, with yes, water. and some. And they just ran oh, out the door, pushing it. And uh, one of the, <laughs> the personnel grabbed the cart. Awesome. Mm -hmm. One of the guys grabbed that. He had that pressure washing. Oh, he he should have been on the Olympic team because he was gone. Did they jump in the car or they just down ran? The, uh, a little further down the parking lot, they jumped in a, a truck jumped and the rolled out. Oh, okay. You know, and rolled out. Mm -hmm. But all yeah. of that is ridiculous. Yeah. It's ridiculous. That's true. It, it, That's true, man. And people are doing it. So, so what? What would well, you no say that that is? 
Yeah. Would you say that that's for those individuals who, you know, don't have enough? They um, in the slums and they just trying to come up and they, you know, this is an opportunity to get that pressure washer so I can even start a little small business or something, you know, because these Fortune 500 Home Depot, they got plenty of stores. They got billions of dollars. So me taking one thing doesn't, you know, hurt them. Kane, they're probably not going to start a, a business. So I know you're laughing. See, that that was comical. Oh, he know I get with that. No, they're, they're, they're just stealing to steal. Yeah, to turn around and sell yes. it for money. And, and maybe and maybe in the comments, y'all probably can say it too as well, but maybe in, he's stealing it, he or she is stealing it to sell it to, to feed their family. They need to feed their family while the kids at school, they out there stealing so they can feed their family. Is that, is that, is that what's happening? Everybody's stealing to feed the family because it's that hard. Maybe it's hard in LA. Maybe that was in LA. That particular store was in, yeah. I know it's nationwide, but maybe it was in LA and the cost of living in LA is ridiculous. We know that. It is. So maybe they, Need that extra money from that pressure washer or that whatever, or in this case, those uh, Nike outfits or whatever they can snatch because you can't get the shoes. The shoes are in the back, but you know the outfits and whatever you can get those and turn around and sell them online or sell them on the streets or whatever. So maybe they just need. But Kane, I'll say this right here. What's that? Once they get their head together, I'm talking about the the leaders regulations, laws pass, and start just prosecuting these people, then it'll go down. It'll stop. It won't. They won't. But so so you gotta I'm not, I'm not so you gotta that. make an example. That's, that's, you gotta make yes. an example of somebody in order for them to like, you know what, I ain't gonna do change that. the law. I know what they do to people who do that. But if there's no consequence for their action, guaranteed it's gonna get out of control. It's already out to me it's already out of control. Oh, yeah, 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 of course, of course, of course. I, I agree with that. But they just going to do it just enough to be up under that radar because it ain't $1,000. It ain't $1,000. So I'm up under that radar. I'm good to go. Because you've seen that in Walgreens and, and CBS. I'm, and They just walk in there and just grab stuff. Yeah, nothing on the shelves. Shelves. Yeah. And, yeah, yeah. So they try to lock everything up. So you got to get an associate just to come over there to unlock the case just to get some bottle of lotion or something. You know, it's ridiculous. I need some milk. And it's, <laughs> yes. and it's, it's, a it's behind a locked case. <laughs> yes. Dude, I've been in places in, 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 in uh, um, different um, grocery stores or whatever. I've been in grocery stores and they have like certain items just behind locked case. Like, why? Why should we have to go through something like that? That's because they don't want their product to leave, and it's been people have been stuffing these things, walking out the door or whatever. So you have to get an associate to come over here and give me a, a bottle of lotion uh, or a little uh, six pack of beer. You, hey, hey, I, I, you need to unlock this so I can go ahead and pay for it and get in line. Yeah, that's ridiculous. We'll meet you at the register. That's more money on the. We'll, yeah, yeah, yeah. Or, or yeah, yeah, yeah. They'll carry it to the register. Yeah. We'll carry it. You don't touch it until you pay for yeah. it. That type stuff, you know, that's ridiculous. I, I know that always been, and y'all know this. It's always been happening in the electronics department in in uh, Walmart. They always have everything locked oh, up, yeah. and you got to get a social. Yeah, yeah, and then and then they want you to pay for it back there in electronics. Oh, yeah. versus going to oh yeah, because you could just take that junk and just keep on walking out of the door. So that's how they usually do. But now, oh my goodness, everything they doing the like day. everything yes. It's ridiculous. It's ridiculous. Congregation, what y'all think about this? Jump in. I need y'all to jump in on this one, man, because I'm like, man, what is going on here? Y'all see the folks at the little uh, um, sporting goods store or whatever, WSS store or whatever it is, but you see how they in there just laughing. Um, Go in there yeah. with garbage bags. It's funny. Yeah. Uh, Grab as much as they can and run out the door. And what, what the little security guard or whoever associate that worked there just, Man, you they would you get in trouble and shot the cag up under? If you, you see, I don't know, it's shoot the cag, Ridiculous. you know, boom. Oh no, we ain't got time for that. 
Yeah, man. Yeah, it's ridiculous, man. I, I I agree with you. We need to arrest them. They need to see a punishment, and then they'll know, is it worth it? Is it worth it? That is it worth it? But once you make somebody an uh, uh, a example, then, yeah, is it worth it? Then it's like, man, I don't know if I'm going to do that. Because you're not going to do that in certain areas. Those areas like uh, on the West Coast and in Washington, Seattle, California, all up in there, they got their little rules where they just let things fly. You come over here on the East Coast or down south or whatever. Hey, thank you. Hey. Okay. <laughs> okay. You not try to do much. that if you yes, want yes, to. Yes, not as much. Yeah, as yeah. That's what I'm saying. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, it, all these little lax rules because you think that they are in some type of bond or whatever, you just creating havoc for your area. That's what I would say to those mayors that are letting this happen or those governors that are letting this happen. It's ridiculous. It's ridiculous. But, well, yeah. It sounds like we need what? somebody. You said the mayors and governors, we need somebody uh -huh. hard on, on crime. Yes. No matter what the crime yes. is. No matter what the crime is. If it's stealing, hey. We're getting them. We're locking them up. They, they'll think twice. They'll think twice. Guaranteed. Guaranteed. Let us know in the comments, y'all. Let us know how y'all feel about this. Uh, I don't like it. I, I, I'm, I'm going to let you know right now. I don't like it. I, I don't care if they jumping in the Gucci or uh, Louis Vuitton mm -hmm. or the doggone Nike store. I don't care where it's at. It doesn't need to happen. I don't care about none you of it. You could be at the Dollar Tree. I still be mad. I No. Yes. No. Yes. I know they can't get a thousand dollars worth of stuff out of there, but <laughs> yeah. still, I don't. <laughs> hey, <can't... laughs> I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Look, that, it doesn't need to yeah. happen. It doesn't yeah. need yeah. to happen. Period. Mm -hmm. That's how it go. For sure. For sure. Anything else for the congregation? That's bro? it. That's it. Yeah. And period. Point blank. And yeah. I, people, you know, your family members that's doing these things. Talk to them. I don't yeah. get anything else from them. Hey, look, you know, the people that know that the people that are doing, they are telling them, hey, when you go next time, give me a, give me this. Mm. You know what they're hey, doing. You know. Okay. You know. Okay. They're like, hey, hey, next time you go, see if you can give me a, this and give me that mm. or whatever. When you do your little, well, you got to pay me. All right. Well, then they'll pay them to go get whatever. No. Come on. Even these little, uh, I know that they do the little heist of the, uh, the Best Buy trucks. I know they do that. Yeah. They just take the Best Buy truck. They get that little stuff and they just, you know, all them electronics, they turn around and sell that stuff. That's what they do. Mm. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, it just needs to stop. Yeah. Roger that. That's, all I, that's how I see it, for sure. And that's the uncomfortable truth. Hey, let's go do it. <laughs> do something. For sure. For sure. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> You know, if you don't want to see us, but you want to just listen to us, we on Apple Podcasts, Spotify, Amazon, Pandora, iHeartRadio, Google Podcasts, all of them, all of them. 